how y'all doing? It's your man Vass here with another episode of Beats and Sneaks. And as you can see, we got the Nike Air Foam Pods in One Premium. And as you can see, the suggested retail right there is $250. It's holiday season, so you already know it's the Foam Pods at Safari. Now, this shoe right here is definitely dope. Set to come out, like I said, November 27th. And for 250, so a lot of people aren't gonna. Well, I can't even say a lot of people aren't gonna get these because just as much as everybody passed up on those last phones and scooped them up around this time, it's holiday season, so a lot of parents and and, and, and a lot of people are thinking of spending more money around this time of year. So it's gonna be hard to say whether or not these are gonna sell out fast or not. If you want them, just get out there or make sure you're on your computer or make sure you got somebody that can get them for you, or whatever. But as you can see the colorway is that architect total orange black and uh that's really it man i guess they call this that architecture right here and if you feel it you can feel those little spots right there that's actually dope and it, and the sole on these isn't as blue as it seems on the pictures it's more like the blue on the Gamma Blue 11s almost. It's not that ice ice blue like that was on the uh, the Royal one that came out not too long ago with the, the gray and blue. But you got that architecture right there. Those are the drops that Safari. Come up. Tong, I always like when they do that black with that little orange detail. like. That's the dopest color to me, black with the orange, when it's a little bit of orange. I like, I'm like. i starting to like it a little bit more than the black and red. Maybe because I have too much black and red, and we're used to it. But as you can see, the shoe is definitely, definitely nice. Now, usually when they do something crazy like this, your first thought is, no, nah, I'm not going to like it. When they first put the pictures of these out, as you can see the Penny Hardaway logo right there. When they first put the pictures of these out, it was a low quality picture and the shoe looked horrible. Then when they updated the picture, that's when everybody went crazy. Like, oh, okay, that's gonna be nice. But this is definitely sweet. I've actually seen like a little North Face jacket that kind of matches this and it has orange detailing in it. And when you wear this shoe and you see like when you actually have it on feet, this isn't going to look as bad as, you know, uh, the thermal look when you first think about it. Like, this shoe is actually going to be pretty dope because it, it is a crazy style, but at least it's just black and white. Just like the fighter jet. A lot of people are shooting themselves in the foot now because they passed up on those. And now they're like, man, I should have got them. But as you can see inside the insole, or if you can't, I'll brighten it up for you. It's all black with the orange Nike Air in there. There's nothing special that comes with the shoe in a box or anything like that. It's just the shoe itself. And yes, these do run small a little bit. So I wouldn't, a lot of people would say go a whole size up compared to whatever you wear in forces. I would say go a half size up because these shoes are meant for you to break in so that you can feel the full effect of the foam posit. Once your foot breaks the shoe in, you get the true feel of what they designed the shoe for. If you get them, if you just get them a size big so that you can rock them right away, they're, they'll still be comfortable, but they're not going to be nowhere near as comfortable as they're supposed to be. They start off hurting and then they feel really good, or you can just get them and they feel decent if you go up the whole size. Okay, now as far as socks, we got this one right here, this Nike joint, as you can see, goes perfect with the shoe, boom, boom, and then you got, you know, the little gray and the little black in there, of course you ain't gonna see that while you're wearing it, but <laughs> I guess if you like me, you take your shoes off if you go to your girl house or something or anybody house who's like who doesn't like people walking with their shoes off you pop your shoes off and boom you still matching <laughs> that's how I, that's how i always do it i think of things like that down to the draws bro but now i'm just playing but as you can see the sock is kind of expensive though but it is their new newer sock that they're doing right now it's 18 bucks so 
that's why and then boom you come over here and you got this shirt form now for some reason this camera is making this orange look brighter than it is now look at this sock and look at how that's looking but watch when I go up to the shirt see that that's how it actually looks just like the sock and just like the shoe but for some reason this camera is making it look a lighter orange than it actually is but as you can see it got the spots on it so that's how you know it goes right with them spots spots and the shirt says nice to beast you this shirt I got at uh, Foot Locker actually and the retail for it's gonna be 28 so I mean the shirt 28 which is not too bad because sometimes they have shirts for like $35 and they be super plain they had like kick game going across it. You be like, what, really? I could've just bought a Hanes shirt and drew on there with a marker, and I'm just playing. But the sock right here is 18, shirt 28, and the shoes are 250. Some people are just gonna say, skip these socks. I would definitely get the shirt, because there's not too many things out there for it. The sock, I mean, I'm pretty sure there'll be even more customized socks for these all over the internet. So, if you needed to save a little money, I would say grab the shirt skip the sock maybe you got a ten dollar off you can get this shirt for like 18 bucks instead of the sock or something like that or if you can do it i mean just get both you know but like i said these drop november 27th so make sure y'all out there y'all have a good one if y'all like what i'm doing thumbs up and subscribe if you don't thumbs down peace